like the those are the spots I was looking at. I feel like low key, bro. You would put the pink on, I would put the black on, nigga. That'd be crazy. Bro. Yo, not nah, facts, but you know what I just peeped? Huh. Both of them are sold out. I know y'all see those stacked with the land vins. That's tough. I got dibs on those jeans. What the fuck you mean <laughs> dibs, bro? <laughs> These are the only ones that I had that I wanted to look at. We could look at shoes. You want to look at them grilled? Oh yeah. Well, it's grilled is basically like the the fashion, the fashion eBay. Literally. You know, be careful because. Do your research, kids. Do your research. You will, <laughs> you will get finessed. You indeed will. Now, speaking of shoes. <laughs> Anyway, now speaking of shoes, I got a very, very, very expensive sneaker collection. If y'all ain't not way, I'll be. I I just be dipping and dabbing in here. Just be dipping and dabbing. I be dipping and dabbing in here, man. You know, act like you know. But you know, still you gotta expand your wardrobe. You gotta have other stuff. But the one shoe that I feel like has gotta get added to my collection is the Landvins, for real. If I don't get a. The Landvin Curbs. Curb sneakers. Those are the ones you slide in, right? No, these are the fat lace ones. Right. Now, Landvins, from their online shop i think they go about maybe a grand to lowest probably nine seven fifty i could be wrong but as you can see here they're all estimates like batman landmans bro those are probably reps i don't know if they're reps but i feel like they could be like either Either somebody customized them and actually did that, made them custom from like actual land bins, or it could be some undercover like land bin, <clears throat> like drop that. It's just like, you just have to know. But come on now. See, that might be it, because in this shot, they have the Batman thing on it, and this one it doesn't. They look a little used though. They look very distressed in the description. Brand new. Yeah, they're lying. Retail was sixteen ninety. Oh my gosh! Did you see that stick bug trying to fly? <laughs> oh, so they are. They are actually a thing. Sacks fifth, eighteen fifteen. No way, Batman lenses are a thing. Yeah, I'm not even like I'm not even mad at that. Those aren't even tough though. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, you hating ass nigga. That's why he don't like anything, bro. This is tough. Um, one fifty for the yeah right. <laughs> Got me further. Um, hundred percent get your shit right man. Get your superhero on and these MFers got it. Purple colorway chunky laces, dummy dummy. Do not low ball, low ball, yeah, yeah. But it's basically grill be that eBay, you know? But let's see. Bottom. How we feeling? We feeling cropped. <clears throat> let's see, crop pants. I'm with just to look at Pants. Yeah, we can end it off with mad shoes. I got a website for that. It's called Farfetched. Uh, if you know, you know. Uh, yeah, no, I'm not messing with this. Uh, Alright. So they're authentic. They're pretty good. Niggas ah. always trying to get you to sign in the shit, bro. I know, bro. Just like, show me the shoes, bro. Anyway. Alright. 
Man shoes. Now they already know. I like rigs. Designer, Maharas, uh, Rap Simmons, stuff like that. So it's probably going to be a lot of that stuff. Kind of like preset in it. Uh, but let's see what they got. I don't know how I feel about these. No. No. How you feel about these? Those are hard as fuck. I don't like the fur. The fur is what makes it hard as fuck. Uh, but I'm a hate ass nigga. You only like stuff that I don't like, bro. <laughs> You're literally like a polar opposite, bro. That's the only way it works. Let's see. Now, I have the... I don't have these Maharas. I have the... The ones that have, like, the, the chunky toe box. But Listen, bro. Converse gang all the way, bro. Converse, nigga. You don't need Rex. You don't need Maharas. Get yourself a nice pair of Converse. Boy, if you don't get... See that. Yeah, I see that chat. Wow, he's gonna probably go show you the converses. I wasn't actually gonna do just that. Know, gonna do just that. know the Maharas. Now I am gonna do that. The Maharas, bro. The Maharas. This nigga they I give care. you like four inches in height, nigga. I'll make you 6'3. Six, 6'3, three. Six, three. you can't beat that. You can't beat that. The converses is not doing that. What, nigga? They're not. Come on, bro. You don't need Maharas, nigga. You don't need my arms, bro. Stop it. <laughs> anyway, I definitely I have to get another colorway of the Maharas though. I think I'm gonna get the high top ones in all white, and then I'll be fine. Maybe one more in like, like just a flashy colorway, but. Let's look at the recently viewed the stuff that I recently view is like what I want and these These are what I want The pink curb the, the pink curb Those are the hardest landings. That's what I'm saying. I gotta get my hands on them I will get my hands on them and when I do you are gonna be sick of me because I probably wear them to death but Man, it literally opened my wardrobe to a lot of pink. Only closest thing that I have to pink is probably the the Cherry 11s. But this, this, it would do it for me. It would do it for me. Just wait on it. Just wait on it. Y'all gonna see the fit I put together with it. And y'all gonna be like... How is this possible? Just know it's not. God did. God did. God did. These were no. Seventy percent price drop in the Raf Simmons, bro. These might be a woman's shoe though. I don't remember. Yeah, they only have this size left. Man. Man. It opened my wardrobe to a whole lot of blue. And so I feel like that's what I need. Probably I need pink. I need more blue. I need more green. More like brown. I kind of got brown from like my Raph Simmons. But, you know, that was just to open it. But. <laughs> Nigga said if that pussy stinky, basically got two buttholes. <laughs> nah, two buttholes is absurd, bro. <laughs> Alexander McQueen's. I feel like they're not as popular as they used to be, but again, they're still Alexander McQueen's. I'd, I'd get a pair of Alexander McQueen's. Not these ones. I think these ones are kind of... I just want to know what made Rick Owens like so popular. Like I feel like maybe they have been around for a while, but 
I just know like recently they just started popping out of nowhere and then like their stuff be like a grand, a band, two bands. But it's something you gotta put together for real. I think what the the most popular Rick Owens are the Ramones. If I'm not mistaken. I'd get a pair of Ramones. Generic, basic, but again, Rick Owens is Rick Owens. What you gonna say? I got Rick's on. It calls rent. Off white vulcanized mid top sneakers. Now, I definitely want me a pair of these. But that price jump from having a 50% off, from it being 415 to 208, and then it going back up is like, where did the. Where did the discount go? But you just gotta you just gotta be in the market at the right time for real. But we need we need some off-white sneakers. Even the black ones. Even though preferably I'd like to have the white ones. The black ones are still tough. 415. I'd probably mix mix and match them. Or same thing, because I have the I have the the black easy 500s and I have the bone 500s and I just switched the laces and I feel like it makes the shoe pop even for both of them but I'd probably do that with that uh, with these All right, we're just gonna look at a couple more a couple more shoes I probably got mad editing to do I made a video literally what was it yesterday or two days ago two days ago Stay on your grind, though. That's all. It. Chase your craft, bro. You shouldn't be chasing these drugs. You shouldn't be chasing these women. You shouldn't be chasing these instant pleasures. Chase your craft, bro. Chase your craft and trust in God. We can look at some rap Simmons now. Now, the Ferrixes, I already have. I have them in the... Let's see if they have the colorway. Um, I don't have them in the black, but if it load, I do have them in this colorway. So, opens the, the domain to a lot of browns, beiges, so, nice shoe, it's comfortable, very, very, very fashionable, very stylish, but, you know, we gotta add to the collection. How do you feel about the Amiri Bone sneakers? Have you seen him? He's a bot, bro. He doesn't even know where he's at right now. Huh? I know what to do, man. I know <laughs> How you gonna start, bro? We've been recording this whole. Never mind. Get right, bro. Get right, get left. He's left, obviously. But <laughs> I'd cop these, the the Amiri Bone shoes. Maybe not in this colorway because I already have them in the Raph Simmons. I don't know. They look too much like the Yeezys. You know what I'm, th you know what I'm talking about? The Yeezy. I don't know. Y'all niggas definitely know what I'm talking about, bro. I, I don't. You're probably going to have to help me with that later. But um, uh, I feel like I don't like this colorway. I definitely like the way they look in this colorway. This colorway looks way more clean, but again, I already have them in this colorway. And I don't like to get shoes in the same color. Yeah, um, laceless Yeezys. The laceless Yeezys? Yeah. They low key look alike, in my opinion. I didn't realize how cheap they were. The 350s? Oh, the 700s. So. Okay, yeah. I can see that. I can see that. I can see that. Well, I don't know. If we're gonna look at a Mary shoes, hello. Okay, I might order some food. Hold on, I might hop on that. Pause. <laughs>
That's how we can't make it cool, bro. Sorry, I had to let that go, y'all. Anyway. Um these. Absolutely. Absolutely. I'd wear these to like a like a first date, you know. First day, you try to have something calm, but like you're trying to show up shoddy, like you still got it. Like, you know, you messing with the kid for real. These is tough. They're calm, they're fashionable, they're stylish. And they just look super clean. Um, 590, Amiri's, fair. That's fair. That's something you just probably have to save up for. And. You know, actually, just have to have money set aside for it. You don't want to save up for it as like 500, and then just blow your old check on it. Like you just have to have 590 put aside and then add up off of that. That's how you save. Like if you if you looking to save to buy, let's say you try and buy some bricks, right? Grind, go to work, do your job, save up a grand, right? Put the grand into some savings, and then mentally tell yourself that you know, you have no money. You have no money and you're basically starting a new clean slate. So once you do that, you'll start adding the money back up. Next thing you know, you have another grand again. Now, a lot of ricks, they're only about a grand, 1200. So you could put the 200 aside and you still have like, what, $800 left over. Now you're not in, you're not in an economic crisis. You're being, you gotta be economically savvy with the, with the things that you do with your money, rather than saving up to the exact amount and then blowing all of it on just a sneaker or a piece of clothes, cause that's, it's not the smart thing to do. But if we really try to talk smart, it's probably not the smartest option to buy these super expensive shoes. But if you're anything like me, you're a very fashionable guy, and you know, you just want to have the latest things on and you actually have an interest in these things. So I can understand that. All right. Uh, I wanted to look at maybe a couple more shoes. Sorry, I, I really like doing this. Like I love, I know there's my peoples out there, bro. I know there'd be mad people out here who just be on here shopping, scrolling, just looking. I'm one of those people. So like me and you, we real, bro. We we heart to heart, but like, you know, I'm gonna have mad editing to do. But, um, let's see what they got on the recommendations. Let's see if we have anything that's jaw dropping, eye catching. I'm not really messing with any of these. Um, hmm. We could do off white. Off white last time. This video is probably about to be quite long. 332. Don't even remember the time we started recording. But as long as we here, staying on our grind, that's all that matters. Um,. Not an odd see, I don't really like this colorway. It's very, you'd have to actually put that on. Like, you'd have to really put something together, have everything, you know, color coordinated from head to toe. That, it's a lot going on for those. Like, I wouldn't even wear like just white or black and then have those shoes. I feel like your outfit wouldn't be doing enough. Mmm. Again, we already talked about the the vulcanized mid top sneakers. Now, hmm. these caught my attention. They kind of give me Balenciaga. Uh, I forgot what they're called, but they give me the Balenciaga sneaker vibes. But I like the colorway a lot. They have an interesting toe box, though. But yeah, the laceless and their Velcro. Yeah, I'd wear these. I'd wear these. 
925 though. That's looking like you you do what you gotta do for real. Uh, I did notice them in the baby blue, but was not as eye catching as the orange and black. It's definitely, it's definitely good though. Bye, y'all. Anyway, I'm, I'm gonna end it here because I already got so much editing to do. And that really be the setback. The recording part is like the easiest part ever for me, but the editing part, I'm like a perfectionist when it comes to editing. But we ain't even go. Would you be willing to head back to campus if Nick goes? I already dubbed it. No. If you want to. No shot. Um. Damn, where did I leave off? Uh. Man, we already went over mass. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um. We're going to end it here. It was fun. I actually enjoyed doing this. I can't wait to actually, you know, buy the fist, put it on, and then, you know, give y'all a showcase of how we actually be putting things on. Y'all yeah, gonna see who the drippier roommate is, you know what I'm saying? You know what it is. We can make this a real comp. I mean, <laughs> but, again, like, we got to get money stuff situated, you know, other stuff situated. We still in college. We still in school. We work out. We got busy schedules. So just bear with us, but trust, we going we gonna to deliver. We gonna deliver, for sure. But make sure you show your your mom, your dad, your auntie, your uncle, your roommate if you have one. Or your emotional support whore. Your emotional support whore, even if they acting up right now. Even if they acting, even if they acting up right now. No, like <laughs> even if they acting up right now. Peace and love, everybody. You know what it is. Make sure y'all get this out. I'm gonna see y'all in the next one. You know what's crazy? Is this is good, bro. This is good. But why not put this energy into a job or something like